Hey guys, the objective for this video is to solve for the reactions of a beam with a triangular distributed load. So first just some theory on a triangular distributed load. So it starts at 0, 0 and goes up linearly all the way to W. So um, you should remember from the UDL um, that had an equivalent point load of WL and since you might know from your high school maths that a triangle is half the area of a rectangle the equivalent point load for a triangle is going to be half of that WL, so WL over 2. And then the distance that it acts, um, you could um, derive this if you did want to, and if you want to, you can do some research on that, but it does act two-thirds of the length away from the smaller end, or another way to think about it is one-third of the length from the bigger end. So let's have a look at a quick question. So we've got here a beam with a fixed support here at A and a triangular distributed load of five kilonewtons uh, per meter max. Um, and we've got our lengths here. So we'll just quickly um, draw in our support reactions. So if you're unsure about this, you should go back to the supports topic. VA there, HA, and then our moment at A, assuming a positive anti-clockwise moment. So first step now is gonna be to draw our